Hey, what's going on guys? In today's video, I'm gonna show you how to rank in Google Maps fast. I'm gonna explain exactly how to do it. It's a do it yourself. You'll be able to do it, so watch this. This video is dedicated to my friend, Darren Marion, who passed away November 14th, 2021. This one's for you, kid. I love you. All right, guys, I hope everybody's doing great. So in this video, I'm going to help you rank in Google Maps in anywhere between four and seven days if you just follow my steps. Okay, so let's get started. The first thing we want to do is we want to uh, buy a program called Local Falcon. Local Falcon, let me give you an uh, everyday example. If you were to hurt your arm and went to it and you go to a, a medical center, uh, the first thing they would do is x-ray your arm, right? They need a starting point. Well, this is a starting point or an x-ray for Google Maps. It lets you know where you're ranking and how far you're ranking out. So, for example, are you ranking just a block or two from your location or are you going out 10 to 20, 30 miles? Uh, Local Falcon will show you where you're ranking. So we're going to come back to Local Falcon, but you cannot do local SEO, Google Maps, Google 3-Pack, Google Business Profile, whatever you're calling it, right, or whatever it's called these days, without a SEO grid program. I have an affiliate link below. I appreciate it if you use it, but you don't have to. Uh, just go straight to Local Falcon and you could down and you could uh, uh, purchase it right, right through Local Falcon, whichever best for you, all right? So we're gonna come back to Local Falcon. So the next thing, that we want to do is I've really fallen in love with chat GPT and with chat GPT what I asked it is please um, please give me uh, five of the best Google business keywords for 24-hour urgent care in Honolulu and it gave me these five keywords I assume these are the best now look you could use other programs like um, SEM Rush to have a free seven day trial, or you could use another program called Ahrefs. There's a lot out there. You may also have a program on your computer. Use that. It doesn't matter. Grab five keywords. I happen to like ChatGPT lately because it's giving me great information and it's free. I use the paid version, but you can use a free version as well. Okay. So next, next. We go to walk-in clinic, open Honolulu, right? I put a keyword in there. And what I want to do is I want to see the GMB category, I'm sorry, the Google Business Profile category that's associated with that keyword. You're not going to rank for walk-in clinic, open Honolulu if you have plumber, for example, or electrician as your GMB category. OK, so you want to make sure that you have the proper GMB category for each keyword that you select. So we went over to uh, uh, ChatGPT and we got five keywords. And let me show you what I did. So I got uh, 24 hour urgent care. That's a keyword. And the GMB category is urgent care center and emergency medical care. And the GMB category is Urgent Care Center. And you'll notice after hours clinic, the GMB category is Medical Center. And then you'll notice the last one, Walk-In Clinic, it's Walk-In Clinic is the GMB category, right? So you want to make sure for each keyword that you select and just start with five to start with. Hey, guys, I hope this video is helping. If you could please give us a like and subscribe to the channel. It helps these videos get out to more people who are looking for this information, just like how you're finding us today. Thank you very much. For each keyword that you select, you have the GMB category. So what do you do next? You go over to your Google business profile, right? And the way to get that is just go to business.google.com and click this part right here called edit profile 
right? So we're going to edit the profile right here. And these are your GMB categories. Now, I'm showing my GMB because I don't like showing my clients GMBs. I don't personally uh, 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 care about my, my GMB for my, for my business, right? So you would add the GMB categories, right? The GMB categories in this order, you would just add them to your Google business profile. You see that? I'll do that one more time. These are your Google business profile categories. Add them to your Google business profile categories right here, right? Easy enough? Easy enough? You're just going to click this profile. You already have the list in Word, in WordPad, or you write, write it down, or you have it in Excel. It's ever easiest for you. All right, guys, we're doing great. We're doing great. So now we have the GMB category, right? And we have the keywords, right? We have them right here. In fact, we took the, we took the Google's business profile categories and we added them to, uh, to our, our Google business profile, right? We added those keywords. Okay, but what does that mean? Well, let me tell you what that means. Anything that you add to your Google business profile, you need to add to your website. So I've never seen this website before, but I'm going to show you how I redesign it because I can almost guarantee, oh my God, I can almost guarantee it's wrong. And sure enough, I can't even believe they're ranking. All right. But it's good that they are. And if it's working, great, great for you. Okay. So what we're going to do is, is we're going to, instead of home, this first link are going to be all your GMB categories. You're going to create a page for each one of the GMB categories, right? So you're going to, you're going to create a page for urgent care center and medical center and walk-in clinic right here. Okay. Then your second set of links are going to be all your keyword pages. So these are your keyword pages, 24 hour urgent care, emergency medical, right? After hours, immediate care, walk-in clinic, right? So you're going to create your second page. If these are your keyword pages where it says first aid tips, those are going to be your keyword pages. It's going to be a drop down, all your keyword pages. Now your third link is going to be uh, your areas we serve. So you're going to see small cities that are that are you know several miles away from your city. You know, don't go all the way. Don't go 50 miles away. Try to go five or 10 miles away. Pick you know three to five cities and write a page on each city. Right now, if you don't know how to you know if if writing really isn't your thing, once again, come back to um, uh, ChatGPT. And, and have them, for example, uh, if there was a city called ABC that's outside of Honolulu, say, uh, hey, please write uh, 1,000 words about ABC Honolulu and please include uh, these words or please include the population and the, the weather and like you really want to get in-depth. So you tell them write an in-depth article and they'll write a nice in-depth in -depth article, okay? After those three links, GMB category, Keyword pages and areas we serve pages, whatever you want to put after that. You want to put patient feedback. You want to put uh, first aid tips. I don't care what you put, but the first three links, GMB category, keyword pages, areas we serve. After that, you could put uh, patient feedback and contact us. You should always have a contact us page on your website. Okay. And the other thing is I would have a nice big phone number right here in the credit cards that uh, you you take. All right. All right, guys. So we're doing great. The next thing you want to do, and I'm going to put this link in the description below, is you want to come over to Moz. And in Moz, you want to get, let's say, for uh, doctors. Okay. So for doctors, you want to get the closest category right and click that and 
you want to get in all these citations, all these um, directories. So you want to go to health grade and you want to fill out a page and put your name, address, and phone number. That's called your NAP. It's also going to ask you for your website address, right? You go to each one of these. These are your most important citations for um, for doctors. These are the top citations for doctors. Now, if you put in lawyers, they would be different. If you put in... Uh, 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 you know, people who do lawn maintenance, it'll be, there'll be other uh, um, uh, directories that you have to put your, your, your business information in, okay? So you want to put these in by hand. You want to fill out a Yelp page, a health grade, super pages, Indeed, Facebook, right? You want to create a Facebook page about your business, and over there it's going to ask you to put in your name, address, and phone number, right? This is going to verify to Google uh, where you're from, right? Because what Google does is spiders out and says, okay, uh, ABC Healthcare is located at 1010 Main Street. Let's take a look throughout the web and see if they really are. Uh, so they go through all these directories and they check your address and sure enough, you are, okay? All right, so these are about 10 citations. That'll, be, that'll do for the first couple of weeks. Now you want to buy citations if you're... If you're in a position to buy citations, I like this place I've been using lately called Citation Vault, right? There's also Web20 Ranker, or you could come over to my friends over at Fiverr, and I used to have a seller that was fantastic, but I don't think they sell anymore, and just put in uh, um, uh, directories or citations right here, and you will get... Uh, as many citations as you need, right? You could get another, I, I would say you probably don't need more than 100, but let them know already what citations you already have, what directories you're already in, so you don't double up on them, right? Say, hey, we're already in these 10, we need, um, you know, 50 more, and that'll be good. And every six months or so, get another 25, eh, that, that should be good. This used to be a huge ranking factor, right? This used to be a huge ranking factor. So I end this video by saying you need three things. This is how you rank. It's as simple as this. You need a website to say that you're a walk-in clinic. You need your Google business profile to say that you're a walk-in clinic. And you need customer signals, either reviews or they are looking for you on Google, right? They're typing in walk-in clinic uh, Honolulu and they're coming to you and clicking your website, right? That's a signal. That, so you need customer signals saying that, uh, that um, you are a walk-in clinic in Honolulu. A review is great, right? That's how you rank. That's how you rank. You do those three things. You got to always keep those three things in mind. Your website, your Google business profile, and customer signals. The customer signal I like so far the, the most is reviews. I think uh, when customers in your zip code, not outside your zip code, don't buy reviews. But if you could get customers to, um, to give you a review and say the service that you provided for them, uh, you, you're going to rank. You're going to rank if you do those three things. Okay, guys, I hope this video helped you. Um, I really try to make my videos very easy to understand, and I, I, I make them the way that I would understand them, right? Uh, um, so I, I hope that you understand them. Now, one of the things that, you know, I make these videos so I could keep your attention but but the thing that I'm real the reason why I'm really making these videos is 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 to help you and help your business grow right because I feel if you could if your business could grow you could do things with your family maybe you could put your kids in better schools and 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 that's what it's all about it's all about your family it's all about it's all about taking care of people and and getting and, and getting the most uh, for people right doing the most for people and I. I know if you're able to build your business, you're able to do that. So if I'm able to make a really good video for you and you're able to grow your business, well, then maybe you're able to take, um, maybe you're able to send your, your child to a better college, 
right? Because, because you made an extra thirty, forty thousand dollars this year, right? So we want to get you in the Google three pack. That's the thing that's most important. You saw my um, cell numbers on the website. I, uh, I mean, on this video, I put on the video several times. So feel free. If you have a question, give me a buzz. I'll be happy to, uh, give me a text rather. I'll be happy to get back to you. I, um, I'm very, very happy to get back to you and answer any questions that you have. And uh, everybody have a great day. And I really appreciate you watching. Please like and subscribe, like I said before. Thank you, guys.